All right, everybody, I'm gonna build a platform uh, out of two by four pressure treated uh, and a few other boards, but uh, it's really, really simple. And it's really to put some of the new hives that I've constructed that are uh, queen mating nukes, two frame. Uh, I can put five frames or a smaller hive on it as well, even an eight frame, but it's really just to hold those uh, out in the apiary. So uh, stay tuned, I'm gonna build that for you. Okay, well, I have pre-cut and started to lay out the frame here. The, um, the frame on the outside is gonna be pressure treated. There are a couple of interior supports that it's fine. These are, these are fine to put in here like that. They'll last plenty of years and I'll probably have a board over the top of it um, by the end. But uh, then I also cut the legs here, which are 20 inch inside, 18 and a half. And then this is out of a two by four. So the what's left is like 77 and three quarters on both sides. So we're gonna assemble that. Okay, well, I'm gonna take a square, square up the end here, where I'm gonna pre drill Make sure that this is a wood bit in here. Okay. I'm gonna take a two and a half inch wood screw, and I'm just simply gonna run a screw up in here. Okay. Okay, well, I'm gonna take this square, put it to the inside of the wood here hold it in place. I'm gonna get this bottom screw started as I just drilled in here. And what that'll do is hopefully get it in going in the right direction. All right, now that's started. Okay. Okay, well I've drilled this side in all the way down. I'm just gonna flip it over and do the other side. I'm making sure this other side is good and square right where it needs to be or really close to it and that to be perfect i'm going to pre-drill this that is not the easiest pre-drill ever it's pressure treated does not take things very well. All right, I'm gonna put one screw in it here. Okay, that ought to get us started. Okay. It's pretty drill. I'm going to make sure that it's square. We'll do this all the way around and drill it in. Two on this side, one on the end. Making sure you do not get your finger behind here. Get a couple more in here and that'll get it tight. Okay, got half the legs on. I'm gonna put this, this one on, do the side, go right in the middle. Push it all the way over, make sure it's clear. Okay. Pretty good. Okay, I'm gonna grab my drill and my other screw. One in here, and then we'll put it in the face. Okay. All right, I'm gonna put two in the face, two on that side, and we'll have the legs. Okay, well, here's the platform. I just simply flipped it over, and I'm starting to lay out some hives. You can see that I can get, this is a five frame that I stuck on here, but I could easily get three in each area. What I, what I want to be able to do is put a board on the end so that I can lay my hive tool on the end. Don't like laying hive tools up on the hive and the bees don't care for it from what I feel like anyway. And then on the supports, that's a good place to be able to put another board in the middle, separate these into little segments, put a hive tool there, a smoker if I needed to, instead of setting it on something else. 
put another board here and then I've already laid a board here on the end but this is a quick look at what a platform will do for you real quickly it'll hold it's not a lot of weight because I'm not supporting honey here this is really just for queen rearing and small hives so uh, it's coming along okay well here's the finished platform <clears throat> got space for hive tools on the end boxes in the middle uh, and uh, you're able to hold all of that pretty quick with about three two by fours you you do or don't have you don't have to put these pieces of wood i like them but uh and then i added a couple of little droppers at the end for some stability so if you like subscribe okay here's the end product set out next to the lake where it's going to be in the spring have new boxes on it all right give it a try it's easy to do